Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it was impressive. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about this uh, four or five matchup in the East. We've got Cleveland, New York. This could be a doozy, Smitty. It is. I mean, so many different matchup nightmares. I know for Cleveland Cavaliers, who guards Julius Randle? Mm -hmm. Because I think he'll be in a nightmare matchup. And Brunson in the guards, Donovan Mitchell and Garland, that's going to be good. But I think I'm looking at Mobley and Jared Allen. They will really protect them. That's the one thing they will do, and I think they will make it a little tough for the Knicks to get points in the paint. So it's going to come down to, I think, for Jalen Brunson is going to have to really get guys in, in place. I love the way he is playing. Um, I can't call this one right now, Jay. This one's going to be good. I think it could be a great series. I think a lot of it's going to depend upon the health of Julius Randle as well. Like, is he, and when he comes back, will he be close on himself? Can he be the player that we've seen over the course of this season? Uh, because I think, to your point, with the River Tex, I think this is a series where three-point shooting is going to be really important for the Knicks. I think they're going to have to shoot it well from beyond, especially when they have the two big lineup, Cleveland. Uh, both teams will have the ability to make a lot of adjustments uh, because of the versatility of the respective rosters. Um, I, I would probably give a slight edge to Cleveland. Um, I, I, To me, I think Donovan Mitchell, mm -hmm. I don't think he gets enough respect. I think he's probably going to be the best player in this series. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, you know, if you look at what he's done over the course of his career in the postseason, he has been nothing short of electric. Mm -hmm. one of his, I think he's got one of the highest all-time scoring averages in the playoffs. whole season. Right. Uh, so you know the moment won't be too big, and then he's got an all-star back me, the backcourt mm -hmm. me with, with, with uh, Darius Garland. So I give them a slight edge, but this Knicks team continues to play well. they got great depth. Uh, they're athletic. They move the ball well. Let's keep an eye on R.J. Mm -hmm. What kind of impact can he have? He could, you know, for the Knicks, he could ultimately be the ex yes. for them. He could be the guy that nobody's really talking about that may need to step up and perform at a high level. John, with your G.A., and I think the, the only thing I look at is Tibbs, how much can he play him? Because Josh Hart mm -hmm. will have to be on the floor, probably guarding the Donovan Mitchells uh, and all the guys, the wing guys that can score. And RJ plays defense, but I think when you have a guy like Julius Randle, also Jalen Brunson, they're going to have to find some defenders in that lineup. It's going to be interesting on how they play Julius Randle, more at the three or more at the four to give other guys some playing time. Can't wait. Can't wait. My